Thank you for joining us today on our user training session with VoIP Dialer Sales. The benefits of using the hosted predictive dialer platform with VoIP Dialer Sales are the dialer automatically eliminates bad numbers, disconnected numbers, and 97% of all voicemails. Is what this means to you is you will have a new contact appear on your screen every 45 seconds. The dialer also dials up to 400 dials per hour to find your next prospect. The dialer has on hold music in between calls that can be changed to any genre of music of your choice. The dialer automatically takes you to the next call after you have dispositioned a lead. The dialer allows you to set a scheduled follow up call with just a click of a button. The dialer maintains all of your completed sales, completed appointments, follow up calls, transferred calls, and assigned calls or leads. The dialer automatically notifies you of all callbacks when you are logged in. Your computer system requirements are as follows. You can use a Windows based PC system or a Mac computer. You will also need a USB headset with a microphone. We recommend the Microsoft LX3000 that can be purchased at Best Buy. You will also need 2 gigs of memory and at least a 20 gig hard drive available space. You cannot use a wireless connection with the VoIP dialer platform. You will need a high speed internet connection and you must have a minimum speed of 1.5 megabytes download speed and 0.786 upload speed. You can go to www.speedtest.net, click on the turning gold star, and it will test your internet settings both for your upload and your download speeds. Next, we will go to voip.voipdialersales.com. This is our secured login for all of our users. You can log into voip.voipdialersales.com from any internet connection in the world. You will now be logged into our secured website. By clicking on the email address, placing the email address in the email tab that you will receive from your admin or your manager. Then you will place your password in. You will click on remember me and I accept the terms of the agreement. At that point, press login. You will now be logged into our dashboard. The dashboard is going to be the first page that you log into the dialer platform. At that point, you will choose a predictive campaign to join. This will also show you your scheduled calls and your past due callbacks. You can also click on My Stats that will show your dialing stats for today, the last hour, or the last month. You will also see four tabs at the top. Your Home tab, which is your dashboard. Your List View tab, which shows you all your scheduled callbacks and all your contacts and your leads. Your contact view is going to be the tab where you spend 90% of your time. Your settings tab enables you to go in and change your different genre of music. At this point we will also need to bring up our X-Lite. X-Lite is a soft phone needed to run the dialer platform. Please make sure it says your new username is SIP underscore whatever your number is. It has to be registered. Make sure that the AA button in the middle is highlighted amber. This enables you to automatically click on the campaign and automatically launches your campaign. If you're having trouble with the customer hearing you, you can actually simply click on the slider bar which enables you to raise your mic volume or if you cannot hear, you can click on the slide bar on the green side, which enables you to increase the volume in your headset. To start a campaign, simply click on a campaign, and the dialer is automatically going to be launched, starting with seven lines of dialing to reach your next prospect. You will see a dialog box that will appear in the middle of your screen. This dialog box will stay there until the system finds your next prospect. You will notice that you will see a green button on your connection tab that shows that you're connected to the dialer. You will also notice that you're connected to the dialer when your disconnect agent connection button appears. The icons that you will see here is click on the green phone to get a contact, the red phone to hang up the phone, 
You can click on the three-way transfer when you're going to transfer a lead or a phone call to a third party. Once you've dialed five to ten calls, you will also see a button where you can actually view previous calls or go to the next one. You also have the option to record any part of your conversation. Clicking or hovering over the speaker will enable you to actually download five pre-recorded voice messages that you can leave. Your dispositions are underneath made contact, completed sale, not interested, or request do not call. The next drop down of dispositions under unable to contact is wrong number, voicemail left message, voicemail left no message, or busy unavailable. To schedule callback, simply hover over your scheduled callback. Call back anyone with a click of a button from one hour to six months, or click on custom to set your own date and time to call this customer back. Click scheduled callback, close the button, and close that window, and now you've scheduled a callback. You can also assign a, a lead to anybody within your system, and you can also choose a custom disposition that is specific to your company. Remember that the system is automatically set up to where as soon as you disposition a call, it will disconnect your co connection with that client, date and time stamp it, tell you who actually did the connection and the disposition, and roll to the next call. If you're going to place any notes in the system, please make sure that you come down into the notes section, type your notes, and add a note before you disposition. Once you're done with the call, then you can disposition it and roll to the next call. On the left hand side, this actually shows you all the information about the client in the system. It shows you their home number, their name, and all the information that you've uploaded. When you come down to any empty field, you can simply click on it, type whatever information you wish to choose to type in, click outside and it automatically saves it. Notice that if your management system chooses to, you can have a pop-up script that will appear in this box. This is a floating dialog box so it can be moved around or simply by click clicking the X will actually close that dialog box. To disconnect from the dialer at any time, simply press the hang up button or press the disconnect agent connection. Once we've scheduled a callback, we can go to our list view to view any and all of our scheduled callbacks. In the list view, all the calls that are going to be housed here will be people or prospects that you will need a call back, any leads that you've assigned to somebody, scheduled callbacks, and your, your goals or your leads. Clicking on any one of these highlighted buttons, such as home phone, first name, last name, city, or last action taken, will sort your entire database. Coming over to a lead, you by hovering over the eye, you can click and view the contact, call that prospect directly, or simply hit the trash can if you want to delete that lead. Should you choose to want to find a prospect anywhere in the database by either name or phone number, simply click their information in the global phone search, press go, and it will find that prospect. Clicking on the settings tab enables you to change your music on hold. Simply click on set up music on hold, go down to your drop down menu, choose the genre of music of your choice, clicking on that music, saving changes, now those changes are saved. Simply log out of the system to save your changes and you are set. This concludes the user training for VoIP Dialer Sales.